Hi, um, I'm Hartmut Kipp. I'm uh, originally from Germany, but I live in Switzerland. So, um, for being a primary school teacher in Switzerland, uh, it's supposed to be 12 weeks in an English-speaking country. And, well, obviously it's a good idea to come to England. So, uh, I had an agency and I got the recommendation to come to ELC. And I was here for five weeks in March and April 2014. Uh, I had a really good time here at a general English course and so I decided to come back uh, now in, uh, in July and uh, I booked a, a special course for teachers now. This is quite an interesting course. We, we were only a small group, only four teachers um, and it was very dynamic. We had really good teachers here I have to say. Uh, the thing is, I really can compare it because I had another course of five weeks on another language school in another part of the country, which was very good as well. But um, I think the really good thing about ERC is that you've got really, really good teachers here. Uh, I think especially if you're a teacher, and they're very good in uh, methodology and clearly, and this is, I think, the modern trends all over Europe, and this really helps. lots of them. So I think the main point for me was uh, you've got a toolbox with lots of new uh, tools and ideas for teaching. Uh, lots of interesting things about evidence-based teaching, about Khalil. I think some of the teachers here are real leading experts in that. And that was another reason for me to come back here because I've got a really good reputation in that. I think it's really useful. I right? really can use the things. The thing is, um, there is something, I think, for everyone. A school like this, you've got, you've got very young people, 16, 17 years old. You've got older ones like me. And of course, we've got different interests. And the thing is that I have got the feeling that the social program covers everything. So um, you've got something like, 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 um, like icebreaker events. You've got on every Monday, uh, you can meet in a, in a cafe, sit together, just talk together, and get in contact with others. And you can do more specific things, sport activities or some cultural uh, art activities, which are very interesting. I think it's, it's really good that it is uh, it's really open and, and wide and you've got lots of things to do for everyone. And I think this is the one point that I, that I really like here. Um, the stuff, the art of, of teaching, this is, is really competent. It shows a, a profession, profession scene. And on the other hand, it's, uh, yeah, it's friendly. People are really friendly and helpful. Absolutely. Brighton is a really interesting city. So I stayed here in, in, uh, in early spring. It was, it was much colder than it is now. It's, it's summertime. But uh, in... in, in Regardless to the, to the temperature, there's so many interesting things to do. There are lots of pubs. Uh, I think that's, that's a big nightlife if you're a bit younger than me. You can go out and there's so many things going on. And it has got fantastic cultural life. There are lots of, uh, they've got these nice gallery, they've got the Royal Pavilion, they've got the, um, the, the Brighton Dome with things going on there. And actually it's only, it's only 40 minutes by train to London with all the, the interesting things to see there. 